Hello, safety team. My name is Craig Romero, and I'm the CEO for Admire My Skin. In this video, I'm simply going to prove that the product in question here is completely safe for use and has been approved by the FDA uh, for topical use on the skin. So the product in question is the Admire My Skin Brightening Serum. This product, I'm going to prove, has less uh, acid or is less acidic than lemon juice. Um, I know we've had some complaints from customers who have said this product has burned their skin. I'm here to prove to you today that that is next to impossible. So let me open up a bottle of serum here. And what I'd like to do is not only put it on my own skin, but I can show you here that I'm going to be... Uh, it's a brand new bottle. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm going to be putting this on my own skin. And through the duration of this uh, test, this will be on my skin. And if it were to be burning, I certainly would be uh, either in pain or um, in a lot of discomfort. So let me wipe the excess off here. I think the main test, though, is that I'm going to be able to show with this pH meter that the acidic level of our serum is less than lemon juice. And I have a freshly cut uh, lemon here. I'm gonna start by squeezing lemon juice into this dish here. Just enough to fill the bottom so that we can stick the pH meter in there. Are you able to capture that? Mm -hmm. Let me start by turning this on. Okay. And I'll leave this in here. Are you able to see the reading? I'll leave this in here for about 10 or 15 seconds. As you can see, the pH level is pretty acidic. Anything below a five is considered acidic but anything closer to zero is even more acidic. So five is, is basic. Anything below that is becoming more acidic. Looks like we're at about a, a 2.17 here. So let me write that down. I'm gonna turn this off. And if you give me just a moment, I'm gonna go rinse this off at the sink so that we can test the serum acidity. I've rinsed off the lemon juice from the pH meter. I'm just drying it now, just to make sure that we have a clean receptor at the end of this meter. And next I'm gonna pump enough serum in here to be read by the meter. Probably about all we can get out of that. We'll let it sit in there for about 10 seconds. Okay, looks like we're at about uh, 2.94. Are you able to see that? Yep, 2.93. So just under three for the acidic level of, of our serum. 
which is, it is acidic, but it's supposed to be. This is an exfoliant. Um, it's meant to gently uh, take away the top layers of skin over time um, after multiple applications. What did I say that was? 2.94. So as you can see, lemon juice being a much lower pH at 2.17 and our serum being 2.94, which is almost a three, which clearly has a, has a significant difference between the two. Lemon juice we use daily. Um, it's applied in food. It's um, constantly touching our skin and lips when we're preparing it and eating it. Um, and our serum here also, which I've mentioned has been approved by the FDA to be a safe topical uh, skin treatment. Uh, I've provided the RIPT testing, which has been uh, tested across 50 human test subjects, or I believe 53 human test subjects. None of those test subjects uh, had any adverse reactions or experienced any uh, burning, and that's been signed off by the consulting dermatologist, which you'll find on that, uh, signed on that test. Um, I've also supplied our FDA certificate, which proves this product has been um, authenticated and approved by the FDA. Um, so I don't know what else I can show you to uh, prove uh, that this product is indeed safe. It's, it's our utmost uh, concern and it's in our utmost, um, uh, what do I want to say? Priority. Priority, <laughs> thank you. It's our utmost priority to make sure that our products are indeed safe for the Amazon community. Thank you so much. If you have any questions, certainly let me know.